We're back with Martha Wade, who even from her earliest life experiences, experienced pain and loss, sexual abuse as a child actress. Tell me, Martha, how did that experience affect you? What, what happened? Well, my parents' best friend, um, he and his wife didn't have kids. And so kind of the common mantra was, oh, God didn't bless them with kids. We as a church community need to let our kids be part of their life because they love kids so much. Um, my parents had no idea um, what was happening behind closed door. And so that story didn't come out until I was in my mid-20s when it became public. And it was discovered that he, at that time, um, that there were over 30 um, victims of his. And the average perpetrator has 365 victims in a lifetime. Wow. So we honestly will never know how many. Um, he only abused girls, but we will never know how many girls were affected by his acts, which were insidious in nature. They appeared kind and, and outstretched to parents. My parents were very, very overprotective. It was the only home where I was allowed to go. And so, this home, I was there and my parents had no idea. My dad did have a nudging, he questioned it. And my mom dismissed it because she thought he was just being prudish. You know, I don't like the way he kisses her. Oh, he's a Christian man, he wouldn't do that. And it was his facade. Um, that's not where his heart was, he used it. He was a wolf in sheep's clothing and yeah. he duped a community. And a lot of parents trusted this family with their young girls. Now you're so passionate to help protect other children. You've actually started a foundation called A Quarter Blue. And I noticed your hair is a quarter blue as well. Coincidence? Not coincidence at all. I am a walking billboard. Yeah. If you were to do a close up, you'll see my eyelashes are actually a quarter blue oh, too. Awesome. And then there's pink there for Ryder. Ryder's favorite color was pink. It shifted to purple, but I want people to know they're not alone and that my story is to reach out and to help others. The same with our lives with Ryder. Yeah. What is the purpose? Well, let's figure it out. I'm not gonna what if my childhood. I'm not gonna what if about Ryder riding a motorcycle. That's so counterproductive. Right. And you have a choice. You have a choice to make purpose out of your suffering. Mm -hmm. um, God is close to the brokenhearted. Nothing that I've gone through, he doesn't get. He was completely betrayed by those who appeared like they loved him yeah. on the cross. You know, God himself lost his son. I'm in good company. Yeah. And how I deal with both is um, either gonna make me or just make my trauma useless. Yeah. And I wanna have purpose in my suffering to reach out and help others.